I quit. Yes, you've read that title right. This is a message that I get on Instagram and YouTube quite a lot from my audience telling me that they're gonna quit their full-time job and think about doing deliveries full-time. I'm gonna work during the daytime today and I'm gonna show you exactly why I don't recommend you quitting your job. I mean, the freedom of being able to work whenever you want, being able to accept jobs and decline jobs, yeah, it's fantastic, but at the end of the day, we rely on demand and if the demand isn't there you're not making no money the time is currently 11 25 a.m and it is a thursday so it's not prime time for deliveries or anything like that and uh yeah we're just gonna get on the road and see how much money we can make today everyone that is new to the channel i basically record my uber eats and delivery shifts here on youtube and just show you guys what it's like we hit 34,000 subscribers, which is absolutely mental. I want to thank each and every one of you for subscribing. Even if you're not subscribed to the channel, your views and comments, um, I really appreciate it. But please hit that subscribe button if you are new. It doesn't cost anything and it means the world to me. So yeah, enough rambling on. Let's get on the road. Yeah, going back to what I was saying about people messaging me on Instagram. I do get quite a few messages saying I'm thinking of quitting my full-time job. I have quit my full-time job to become a delivery driver. If you live in a little town where there isn't many drivers, then yeah, you can make a decent amount of money and you can live off of it. It's just, it's just one of those things. So I thought I'd just get out and show you what it's like to work during the daytime. I know most of my videos are in the evenings and it is very dark on the channel. Don't know what time I'm going to finish. I was going to do a 9 till 5 because that's normally what time people work in a normal job. But with the freedom of being able to work when you want, uh, you wouldn't really be getting up at 8 a.m. So, um, yeah, I'll bring you back when the first one comes in. So there we go. We have our first order of the day picking up from a Caribbean restaurant. It's only around the corner. Let's run around and grab this order. There we go, we'll take the thermal bag. All right, so the first order's been picked up. It's four suits, <laughs> which is a nightmare to transport, but it should be all right. They've all been cling filmed. And it's going uh, 1.4 miles. That is quite close, actually. I've got these really nice Alpine Star trousers now that I uh, got from Go Green Motorcycles. So shout out to Go Green Motorcycles. They've got some great kit down there. And um, yeah, very, very nice trousers. These are very nice. buzzer isn't working. Hello. Hi, it's your delivery driver. I'm trying to ring the buzzer but I don't think it's working. Oh. Oh yeah, no, I pressed that but it's, um. when I press 48 it's coming up with one and then some random number. Yeah, 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 so I, I don't know. It will come up as one but um, I don't know why it does that. <laughs> Alright, there we go. It's working now. <laughs> Hiya. Thank you. Have a good day, yeah? Thank you. All right, that's the first one delivered. For the 24 hour shift, the date has been set and it's, uh, it's gonna be happening. Yeah, and that is in aid of Glassdoor, which is a homeless charity. So hopefully we can raise some money for them. Uh, we've got an order coming in, picking up from Iceland. Pick up this Iceland's order. All right, so this is the first time I've had a order on Uber Eats after like 3000 deliveries. We're saying two plus delivery partners. This is, an a lot, this is a large order, so you only need to pick up part of it. I'm hoping I'm not the second driver to this pickup because what drivers love to do is take one item and leave the rest for the second driver, which is an absolute liberty. So yeah, hopefully I'm gonna be the, the first one there. And no, I won't just take one item, I'll take whatever I can carry 
but drivers love to do that they take one item and <laughs> leave like 10 bags for you to pick up which is so messed up I don't know if I can go in this bus lane I don't think I can so I'm just going to stay with the normal traffic hiya where do I pick up the uh, Uber Eats orders? Yeah? Okay. Let's give the customer a call and see if they've got their stuff. I wanted to see if you received your items. Okay, no worries. I just wanted to make sure that you did get your stuff. That, that was all. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. I could just drive to the location and say that I've delivered it, but I'm not going to cheat the system like that. There's no point, because if you get found out, then it's not going to be good. Not worth, not worth uh, risking the account for something so little. But we did get an order on Deliveroo in the meantime. Thank you, bro. Cheers. Alright, so we're going 1.3 miles away. Going over Westminster Bridge, which is something I don't want to do, but we'll do it and then come back over the south side of the river. I hate riding in the city. It's just, you can't do anything without getting a fine. It's really not worth it. So I thought we was going over Westminster Bridge, but we're not, we're going over Lambeth Bridge, which is the bridge before Westminster Bridge. But still, we are going over the other side of the river. And uh, yeah, we will be returning straight afterwards. It isn't a nice looking day here in London today, but we have to get out. We have to make some money. I hope you're all doing well. Hope you all had a great New Year's and Christmas. I can't believe I'm saying that minutes and minutes into the episode, but yeah, I hope you had a, a great Christmas, everyone, with your family and your loved ones yeah happy new year to everyone a new year new beginning as they say dun, dun, dun. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. go on mate is going on around here see what i mean i've been over the bridge for two minutes a car pulls out and a woman just walks into the road this is why i don't like the city everyone's just so like go 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 100 miles an hour i don't care if i get hit by a car or a bike i gotta get there no matter what it's ridiculous hi delivery right thank you all right that delivery is done the only good thing about coming up into the city is most apartment places don't let you in. I mean, the resident has to come down and collect the order, which I don't mind. It makes my life easier. But yeah, we'll do an hour hourly update. Nine pound nine pence on Deliveroo and absolutely nothing on Uber. But we're gonna go back online with Uber. Order picking up from Leon. Don't wanna go back empty handed. So we'll go back with an order and the pickup's just around here on the left. Oh yeah, pick a nice one here. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. We've arrived at this location. The customer has kindly included a two pound tip, which helps and is very, very nice and appreciated from uh, every delivery driver. I mean, if you expect tips, then you're in the wrong job. I don't expect tips. And I think tips should be given after the drop has been done because you never know what the service is gonna be like from, from the driver, you know? Look like a proper biker now, don't I? Yeah, these are the trousers that I've got with the uh, RST jacket. Loving it. 
Hi, just Hi. in there for you. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Delivery done. So yeah, the jacket, RST. Got the uh, padding on the shoulders and uh, elbows. Also got some padding here. Fully waterproof, windproof, everything. So, so nice. And it's so comfortable as well. But yeah, that last would have paid £5.26. Let's get back to the bike and I'll catch up with you in a moment. Order there coming in, picking up from the same katsu place as earlier. And the pickup isn't far either, literally just down this road. All right, Valentino Rossi, slow down, mate. Jeez Louise. Hi, mate. 8726. Cheers. Oh, come on, bag. There we go. Arrived. Just an FYE. Thank you. We're on £18.33. There's still nothing on Uber. What I've noticed with Uber, since I've since I've changed over my account to motorbike, I'm literally getting no orders whatsoever. Whereas Deliveroo, I'm getting loads of orders. So yeah, it's a weird one. But I'm gonna go grab a coffee and I'll uh, catch up with you in a moment. Break completed. Time has just hit 1.30. Gonna get back on the road. And yeah, see if we can get some more orders. But it sure is quiet today. I mean, I've only been online for two hours and I've made 18 pound 33 in two hours. Isn't fantastic, but we continue. I'll do a U-turn actually. this road here yeah an order on uber hiya yeah. two point two miles away let's get on the road this place is nice look at the gates on this place god damn It is beautiful here. Very nice. Ooh. And it's a big old building as well. All right. I think this one we just have to give to the uh, concierge, which is nice. Perfect. Thank you. Nice place, eh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one day, one day. Well, yeah. <laughs> you can even watch the news in the yeah, lift. I see in one, uh, one pajama for rent. Yeah. 11,000. <laughs> A month. Yeah. Jesus Christ. A delivery 24 hour you have to do. <laughs> Good day, yeah? Cheers. £5.77, that one paid. 11 grand a month though. I mean, geez Louise, that is so much money. So much money. But then, there are people out there making that sort of sort of money, you know? So they can afford it. All right, he's just opened them gates. So I'll go out. Oh, I'm, I'm sure he can open them again, but I just don't want them closing on me. Whoa, let's see if we can trigger them sensors. No, there we go. Yeah, lovely jubbly. All right. I need to uh, strap up my helmet because I forgot to do that. There we go. 577. We'll go back online with Deliveroo. Baby girl love my bop and I like me too. No roof on my top and my babe see through. Hating on the pen, don't stop, they ain't gon' feed you. I've been all on my ground, so why I need you? 
our first double order on Uber Eats. Just gonna go over here and pick it up. So these are like ghost kitchens here. There's quite a few of them inside one unit. All right, we have both of those orders. The first one is 1.4 miles away. We're dropping off to Chelsea College Art of Design. There's gonna be an outside pickup, which is lovely. Just waiting for this customer to come down. But yeah, time now is coming up to half two. Much. Right, take care. All right, let's get this next one dropped. We are going back over the river. Yes, that's the one. All right, cheers. Thank you very much. Have a, good day. Have a good day, yeah. All right, delivered. And I also got a notification. I got a three pound thirty tip. Three pound thirty four tip from a previous customer. All right, people. So I'm still waiting around for an order. It's just gone quarter past three. I'm gonna call it a day just because it's gonna start chucking down, and yeah. I've got a cracked screen on my phone, so the last thing I want is some water getting in there and damaging the phone. But yeah, we'll go through the earnings all together on Deliveroo, £18.33. Uber Eats, £12.32. Gives me a grand total of £30.65. But I hope that gives you an insight to what it's like to work during the daytime. It's not always great doing this job and you can't make an amazing amount of money it's only going to get worse as well when the students go back home in the summertime everyone knows the demand plummets and orders are pretty much non-existent in the summertime especially everyone's out i hope this gives you some sort of information um, to help you make your decision if you are thinking about quitting your job and moving to deliveries full-time but yeah the next episode you see well, I'll be out on the e-bike again and uh, the 24 hour shift is coming very soon. I'll leave the fundraising page down below so you can check out the information and see the charity that I am raising money for. And yeah, I look forward to bringing you another episode soon. Don't forget to leave your likes and comments uh, down below and subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Take care and I look forward to bringing you another episode very soon. Peace. It's very nice.